What's up everybody, APOC here. Uh, I was tagged by MC Murr on my three coolest things in my collection. Um, now, I've started my collection over uh, about seven years or so ago. Seven years or so ago, I sold off everything in my collection, um, everything but one console. So I pretty much started from scratch back in May of this year uh, to reboot my entire collection. Now everything behind me that you see is everything I've been picking up from garage sales, yard sales, Craigslist, offer up, pretty much everywhere else out there. Uh, found some awesome stuff, a lot of boxed games, some really cool titles, uh, but nothing super rare. Uh, the three coolest things that I kind of have in my collection I haven't shown on the channel before. Um, and I just wanted to kind of bring them to you. These are kind of the three coolest things to me. Uh, they might not be the coolest things out there, and they might not, you know, be the three coolest things that I have in my collection to other people. But three things you guys haven't seen yet, and three things that are, you know, the coolest things to me. Uh, we'll start out with the one console that I still have back from when I was a kid, the one console that I haven't sold off, and that's my Atari 2600. Old reliable. Um, many years, or uh, many hours have been played on this thing. This was actually my dad's, uh, was passed down to me and my brother. All of the other consoles, like I said, sold off, but we did end up keeping this thing. I love playing this thing. Uh, the old Pong, still kind of, yeah. I still have a few of the games that I had back when we were kids still with it too. Um, just bring back lots of memories from, uh, from my childhood. Very happy that I still have this thing. Uh, still works, still have all the original connections, so that was number one. Uh, the second one is kind of, I had to think about it uh, when I was running down everything that I have in my collection, on kind of what the second coolest thing is in my collection. Uh, and when you see what it is, it's kind of like, what, really? Um, but there's kind of a story behind it, and uh, it kind of is, is pretty cool to me. Um, and that is... A Nintendo Wii. Um, now this is the Japanese version, this is not the American version. Uh, and the reason why we got the Japanese version, we had it special ordered and shipped over from Japan, was so that we could play the Naruto games. Uh, the Naruto games came, back, uh, came out in Japan a lot sooner than they came out over here, so we could play the Naruto Shippuden and the other, the other titles we have. Kind of like a Mortal Kombat fighting game. They have a few titles. Uh, really good fighters. If you guys haven't played these games, these games are awesome. Especially in Japanese. They're just way better. Um, awesome titles. Unlockable characters. Just everything out there that's really cool. Uh, and these are the only games that my wife will actually play with me. Now, she's not a big gamer. She's really not into video games whatsoever. Um, but if I say, hey, let's pop on one of these, she grabs a GameCube controller and she says, let's go. So that's the other reason why I love this thing, the Japanese Wii, is, uh, you know, kind of gets my wife involved into uh, kind of what I'm into as well, too. So holds a special place. And then the other thing that I have, my third thing, uh, is something you guys probably see every time you see my channel. Uh, I never did a pickup on it because it came with a bunch of other just random stuff, um, but nothing that I ever thought warranted a video or anything like that. Um, but is actually really cool. Got a lot of comments on it. Everybody kind of looks at it, wants it. Uh, and that is my Orange 64. Um, Nintendo 64 is probably my favorite console of all time. I love the games on it. Just love the nostalgia. This is what I spent most of my childhood playing on. Uh, if it wasn't the PC, it was on the Nintendo 64. Um, GoldenEye, Mario. You know, all the classics. Uh, and I never saw the Fantastic Colors, the Pikachu, when I was growing up. And uh, when I started seeing these in the wild, when I started uh, video game collecting this summer, uh, I sold off all five of the Jungle Green ones that I saw. Now that I found this one, I kind of wish I would have kept one of the Jungle Greens so that I could have started the Fantastic series. Um, but I have a feeling I'm going to run across them again, so... But this is the third thing that's in my collection that's definitely the coolest thing. 
So, um, yeah, that's about it. All right, everybody. So, yeah, that was the three coolest things in my collection. I uh, appreciate everybody for watching, but now it's time for me to pass on the torch to three other YouTubers. Uh, the first person I'm going to tag is the Wood Baron, the Retro Game Hunter. You have been tagged, sir. Please, what is the three coolest things in your collection? Uh, the second person I'm tagging is that retro, uh, the Retro Social Work Game Hunter. Uh, another smaller channel out there, but definitely a fantastic channel. Please, everybody, go check it out. Uh, sir, you have been tagged as well. Uh, and the third person I'm going to tag is that zombie guy. Uh, the guy just finds amazing stuff. Just nonstop weekly pickups of just insane finds that I keep seeing him post. Sir, you have been tagged. I would like to find out what you think your three coolest things in your collection is because I swear I watch your channel and every week I think that those are the coolest things in your collection. So those three YouTubers have been tagged. Their channels will be in the description below. Please go check them out. Uh, and I appreciate everybody for watching. Thank you to everybody. Uh, thank you to all the new subscribers. Drop a like on the video, comment down below, and if you're not subscribed, please subscribe. Plus, like I said below, there's that little bell right down here. If it's not clicked, please click it. It'll let you know when my new videos pop up. Again, thank everybody for watching. See you guys later.